Good morning guys, Julia here and today I'm gonna share with you the skincare that helps me to survive tretinoin. I use tretinoin every uh, two nights or um, two times a week depending on the condition of my skin and so these are the products that help me to keep my uh, skin hydrated that helps to reduce flaking purging and also calm down the irritated skin so um, I'm gonna remove the makeup now and then I'm gonna apply this product one by one okay let's dive into it okay I'm back I removed the makeup and now my skin is completely bare as you can see it's not in the best condition I have a lot of these mini red spots and pimples and other things happening here but overall um, the skin does not feel tight that's what the most important to me because I hate this feeling of tightness where I cannot even smile without being afraid to crack your cheeks first product that I use on bare skin is this Neogen real ferment, ferment micro essence made with 93% of micro bio ferment complex it is very watery, it feels exactly like, like, just like water. But surprisingly, it's much more hydrating than water. So, if at some time, sometimes after evening, um, sometimes after double cleansing, I want to apply the mask first. For example, I use LED um, current body light therapy mask, and that mask is supposed to be applied on the bare skin. I don't feel comfortable wearing um, mask for 10 minutes on a bare skin so I splash this essence first and even though it's so thin but it's very hydrating so my skin feels very comfortable just with this essence alone. The next step is Stratia. Stratia uh, Rewind. This is a vitamin rich hydrating serum and I really love the texture of this serum. It has this slipper, it's very watery and slippery it it kind of adds a good layer of uh, protection to your skin and it gets absorbed within seconds okay oh that feels so good it's it has no scent or maybe it has i don't know i'm not very good at identifying scents like my nose is not good for that uh, I think it's unscented, <laughs> I think so, and yeah, I feel like it's really so, so comfortable. And right now it's tiny little bit tacky, but not like super sticky. Can you feel it? Can you see it? <laughs> like that. Okay, so the next step, until just a few days ago, was uh, another... Uh, a Neogen product and that is this serum it has just finished it's like it's almost finished but I cannot get it out from the bottom because of this pump honestly it's not very comfortable the packaging okay so if that's the most I can get it just doesn't want to go out that's all <laughs> that's all I can get but uh, once again I really love the texture of this product and it's very soothing, very uh, moisturizing and it feels good, yeah. Okay, the next layer is Stratia, famous liquid gold. Okay, please excuse my uh, name. <laughs> I think because my hands are often oily that's why the the um, sticker got misplaced okay so how I use this is I put maybe two or maybe like this three little pumps in my hand and then I combine it with also Stratia Fortify oil this is a facial oil and although it has some great properties but I'm not a fan of the smell and that's why I only use two drops so I drop them into this uh, liquid gold and now I'm just gonna use my finger to mix it together like that and then apply it on the skin I love the color of this 
of this product. It feels so luxurious to apply it. Seriously, it's like... This uh, liquid oil has amazing ingredients. One of the uh, key ingredients is ceramidine and then uh, niacinamide and um, sea buckthorn oil, which are very, very good for skin. And at first, when you apply it, it feels as if your skin is going to have this yellowish tint, but believe me, it it will disappear in a maybe not in a few minutes but eventually I cannot see it so now after applying all these layers the skin feels so smooth and so moisturized and I honestly think that this product helped me to maintain the skin in a good overall condition of course, if I use tretinoin too often, like sometimes I, I tried to switch to every other night and immediately I realized that it was too soon, <laughs> my skin was not ready to it. And, but if I use it every second night or every third night and I maintain this uh, skincare routine, so then my skin feels very comfortable. It still flakes and purges, as you can see. But uh, most importantly, it doesn't feel tight and it doesn't feel sore or irritated. And if it does, which happened just a few days ago when I overused the tretinoin. So here's what I do. I use this mask. Where is it? So if my skin feels in particularly irritated, I use this mask. This is um, Beauty by Josom and Santella Asiatria Common Mask. They look like this, very beautifully packaged. This is the mask inside. And I apply it for about 15 minutes and it works really well to calm down the irritated skin. So for example, um, three days ago, my skin was really, really sore and red and flaking. So I used this in the evening and then after this, I followed up with this skincare and the next morning, it looked as if nothing happened, as if it just healed overnight. So I really can recommend this mask. But if your skin is not irritated and you use this mask, probably you will be disappointed because you will not see any result at all. Like when I just purchased it, my skin was not tight and dehydrated. And I tried this mask and I didn't get it at all. It was just like nothing happened. I mean, my skin was just like before. So make sure that you use it when your skin really needs it and then it really works. So, okay, so all of these products, I use them in the morning and some of them I use in the evening too, but I add some extra ingredients um, that I want to work over. Oh yes, one more thing. I forgot one very important layer for the morning skincare routine. That is sunscreen so um i have three sunscreens and this one is my all-time favorite um it is bior uv at at slism honestly i don't know how to pronounce that do you know this word what is that at slism so um it has a very soft like a little bit like a souffle texture let me see if i can show it to you here like this. Okay, probably I need to apply more than this, but I will start with that that amount. Just like any other Bior sunscreen or chemical sunscreen, it doesn't leave a white cast and it feels very comfortable. It it has a bit of a devy finish. So if you prefer matte finish, so you may try another um, Biore sunscreen. It's also red color, but it's in a bottle. This one is in a tube. The other is in a bottle. It, it has the same name, but it's called Milk. So this one is an essence and the one that has a powdery finish, like a matte finish, it's called Milk. Uh, I have both, but I prefer Devi finish, so this one is my favorite. Also, the makeup goes better on this one, because when you have this powdery finish, the makeup just do not stick on well. 
Okay, so now I'm fully ready for the day. And okay, don't forget to apply your sunscreen on the neck and wherever, whatever part of your body is open, okay? Okay, so this was my products that I use in the morning. And if you want to know what is my evening skincare routine, then subscribe to my channel and comment below and I will make another video about it. All right, thank you so much. And let me know if you have any questions below in the comments.